Hello guys, here I will show you how to create a simple gun chart. Basically, it is a basic gun chart with a dynamic taskbar to cover only weapons. I will start creating from the blank worksheet, so you can see the progress from the beginning until the end. I started by typing basic information for my project. It could be different among any projects, but you can follow this to start learning about how to create your gun chart. After finishing typing titles for your project, you can start to write the titles for your gun chart tables. Parts of gun chart table header is dates columns where the dates will be used as reference to create conditional formatting to map workdays into dynamic taskbar. The project start date will be used as the reference for the first date column. Here, you must define how many columns that you want to have in your project. Number on top of the table just a helper to inform you how many columns that you have created. If you want to create one year project, you might create about 365 or 66 columns. In increasing the dates, Basically, is as simple as dragging the first date into the end of the column that you want to create. After that, you can start to customizing how the dates will look in your cells here. You can use the formatting cell features or formatting cell menu in your Excel. And then you can start to type your project information here. Here I put dummy project information to be used as a reference to create the conditional formatting formula. Information that I put in this gun chart are uh, level information, tax description, assignment information, start and end dates of each a task and there is a number of work days column that will be used to calculate the number of days for each employee for each task I try to speed up the process here Since it is a simple gun chart, calculating the number of days is as easy as subtracting the end date with the first date plus one day, as you can see in this column here. Now your gun chart table is ready to be customizing with the conditional formatting formula that will map 
the workdays into a dynamic taskbar. To create a conditional formatting mo formula, you must select all cells where the formula will be applied. Then you can open the conditional formatting formula menu to start typing the formula. The logic is to compare its dates in Ganja table header with start and end dates in each row. As you can see here, if the date in the title is greater from the start date or lesser than the end dates, and then the cell will change its color with the color that you have specified in this menu. And here I choose a dark gray color to map the workdays. And if you type your formula correctly, you will see all of your workdays now have been mapped into a dark gray color in a gun chart table. Then you can start uh, customizing your gun chart to make it look nicer. The common question is, what about if you want to insert extra tasks in between other tasks? Uh, will the formula will follow? The answer is yes and no. But in this sample, the answer is yes. And after you finish personalizing your gun chart, you may now start preparing your gun chart to be printed. Okay guys, that's all. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.